As you heard for yourself in the scriptures, Jacob didn't want the Canaanite bloodline to mingle with his own seed. The Most High wanted to create a righteous seed on the earth. A cursed people cannot be the foundation to a holy righteous people. The Canaanites were pagans and idolaters. That is one of the reasons Isaac said to both of his sons not to marry the Canaanite women. Also, Jacob understood that the Most High wouldn't be pleased by his son's actions if they chose a Canaanite woman for wives. The Most High preserved the Israelite bloodline despite the workers of iniquity falsifying history and misinterpreting the scriptures. Today, in the false awakening, we have Israelites proclaiming that they can marry whomever they want and the child born to them by the strange women and men will be Israelite and accepted by the Most High as righteous. The Most High killed Judah's sons from the Canaanite woman. Yet we have Israelites believing the Most High made an exception for them. Despite the Most High forbidding the sons of Israel not to mingle their seed with the strange women, also, not to give their daughters to the other nation's sons, they created a false doctrine to please the lust of the flesh.